नमस्कार सम पीपल से ये योगा मुझसे नहीं होने वाला आई हैव बीन टीचिंग योगा फॉर मेनी इयर्स एंड आई वुड लाइक टू एश्योर यू दैट योगा सबसे जरूर होगा योग हैज न्यूमरस बेनिफिट्स फॉर माइंड एज वेल एज बॉडी टूडे आई विल बी शोइंग यू सम योग आसन सीक्वेंस दैट इज गुड फॉर बिगिनर्स हु आर इन गुड हेल्थ इन दिस टेन मिनट सीक्वेंस वी विल बी फोकसिंग on some easy yog asanas by the end of these practices you will feel more relaxed centered and energized remember to listen to your body language and push only that much which you feel comfortable so let's begin with the asan sequence for the beginners so now understand how to do these asanas talasan 2 stand straight with one foot gap between two feet hands besides your body Now inhale raise your both the arms up and simultaneously stand on your toe stretch yourself upwards fully hold your breath for some time and while exhaling rotate both your hands from behind and simultaneously bring your heels also down both these movements hands and feet movement should be properly synchronized along with it breathing also should be synchronized you should take a full breath in hold full breath out and stay for konasan 2 stand straight with 3 to 4 feet gap between your both legs hands besides your body now raise your right hand from the side palm facing upwards and bring your arm up to your ear and your head and arm and the whole body should be bending to the left side with all this you have to inhale fully stay there for some time and then slowly while exhaling come back to the original position repeat the same thing on the other side this is a very good stretch on your waist line and do as much as possible third is standing vakrasana keep 2 and a half feet gap between both the legs feet parallel to each other firmly get both your hands up at the shoulder level palm facing downwards now looking at your right fingertip twist your whole body from the right side and go behind do this while exhaling and then while inhaling come back to the normal position repeat the same on the other side fourth asan is yoga mudra sit on the floor in sukhasan or in padmasan hold your left wrist with the right palm behind first while inhaling roll your shoulders back and then while exhaling try and relax your shoulder and bend forward at the center stay there for some time and come back again now parvatasan in parvatasan raise your both arms up from the side and join both arms in namaste position above your head stretch your whole body upwards hold the breath for some time and then while exhaling turn your palm outwards and roll it rotate it and bring it down back to normal position now let's do bhujangasana here person has to lie down on stomach in bhujangasana lie down on your stomach straight and put your forehead on the ground both the palm facing downwards aligned with your chest elbows upwards not protruding out with the body now slowly while inhaling first raise your head up then neck and then little bit shoulders up look upwards and then while exhaling come back to your normal position another posture is yastikasana here you lie down on your back while inhaling raise both arms up above the head and simultaneously put your toes outwards so that your whole body is in a stick way arm movement foot movement and breathing movement all should synchronize together neuromuscular coordination stay there for some times and then slowly while exhaling relax your whole body bring your arm from front to the normal position both the toes again in a relaxed position now let's do power buktas now lie down on your back straight now gently bend your right knee and get it towards your chest try to hold your shin of the right leg with both the arms while doing all that you are supposed to exhale hold it for some times 
Inhaling, release your leg, get it to the static position. Do the same thing on the other side with other leg. And finally, when you have done with each leg, then do the same thing with both the legs. Now let's do Haspada Gushthasana. Lift your right leg straight above as much as you can. Try to hold the toe if possible. Otherwise, stay in that position for some time with raised leg. And while exhaling, bring it down. Do the same with the left leg. Exhaling, lift your leg up. Do the same on the side. While exhaling, take your right leg towards right side to try to touch your toe. And bring the leg come back. In all these movements, your legs should be straight. And now finally, let's sit quietly in Sukhasan position. Both legs crossed with each other. The distance of knee should be even from the ground. Arms, both the palms on your thigh. Relax your shoulders, relax your elbows. Sit straight. And now, close your eyes. And try to see that you are just watching your breath. Stay in this position. It's a beautiful meditation technique. Sit in this position for some time as long as you are free from thoughts and stay in a quiet state and then open your eyes. So, this is the sequence to be followed for the beginners. This sequence will help you to connect your body and breath. Doing these asanas in the morning will help you to reduce your dullness and tamas so that you will begin your day with high energy and positive strength. It also helps you to be more mindful and calmer in situations that are challenging. So motivate your body to follow these routines. Practice yoga regularly and stay fit from the inside and from the outside. Namaskar.